I'm so glad you stopped by today. If you're new to my channel, or if you're returning, hello and welcome. My name is Sharon. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit it twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. Today on Creative Glam, I am participating in a collaboration. And this collaboration is called the $5 Goodwill Challenge. And it's being hosted by Hillary of Old World Homes. I will leave a link to Hillary's channel down below in the description box, along with the playlist. I want to thank Hillary for hosting this seasonal challenge. I enjoy it so much and I look forward to it every year. Uh, these particular vases slash candle holders are something that I've had for a long time that I no longer use. Today, I don't know what I'm going to do with these vases slash candle holders. I did not even know that this was an actual candle holder till I flipped it over when I was cleaning them off. I did not, I realized at that point that that was a hole for a pillar candle. Um, I thought that was kind of cool. So let's get started with freestyling some decor using these vases slash candle holders. I went online and I found a picture of a farmhouse window frame. I printed out two of them. I'm going to cut them down to size and use them as a backdrop. I printed it out as you can see in three parts two times so I scaled it to the size that I needed it and then I printed three sections twice so I can get the double window pane look for my backdrop now I'm going to tape it to the cardboard frame Since I did not have a mirror like this, and I saw one at the dollar spot at Target, and I didn't pick it up. And don't you hate when you see something and you were like, oh, I should get that, and then you don't, and then you're like, oh, I regret that. Well, that's what's happening at this moment. I wish I had it. I wish I had picked it up, but I didn't. So now, I'm going to create it myself. I was like, well, I didn't pick it up at the dollar spot when I had the opportunity, so I will DIY it today. I've got time. <laughs> then I'll just cut the extra off the top and the bottom. And those are my two $5 challenge items. I think I'm going to use this one here. I think I'm going to use this one here as a candle.
And this wreath, I know my Redeemer lives, what comfort this sweet sentence gives, is a download that I got from Heidi Sumball. And I put it in this frame from the Dollar Tree. The glass and the dollar, unfortunately the glass broke. So I'm gonna use the frames without the glass. And the bunny you'll recognize from the Dollar Tree. The pillar candle I got from Home Goods. My two Goodwill $5 challenge of vases slash candle holders. The topiary was something that I already had, as well as the wreath. The picture frame I got from the Dollar Tree, and inside of it I printed out, uh, I downloaded and printed out a wreath. Okay guys, that's a wrap. I want to thank you all so much for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed my $5 Goodwill challenge. Thanks Hillary, I had lots of fun as usual. For all my new subscribers, thanks for subscribing and welcome to the Creative Glam team. I appreciate you. And for all my returning subscribers, as usual, thank you and thanks for your support. And if you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button below along with the notification bell. Hit it twice so that you don't miss out on any of my future videos. And make sure you leave me a comment. I'd love to hear from you. And I'd also appreciate it if you gave me a thumbs up. Have a blessed day and be safe out there. I'll see you right back here next time on Creative Glam. Bye.